Welcome to my channel, uh, Virtual Reality Gaming. My name is Blake. Well, today we're going to be testing Distillo Dexcom. And we're going to make sure if it's going to work for my iOS device. I got, uh, we're going to work it to the iPhone and we're going to work it to my Apple Watch Series 9 and we're going to sync it to the Aurora Ring 4. And uh, then don't forget to follow me on Facebook and Twitter and my Discord channel. And I'll leave all the links down in the description down below. And most of all, hit the subscribe button for all of my future content. But yes, as you've seen in my last video of how I did the unboxing video of the Stello set and other step by step with the Android and everything. And I don't recommend Galaxy watches or any smart watches because a lot of them are not capable you know, for Stellar Dexcom. The only thing, only smartwatch that is capable for Stellar Dexcom is the Apple Watch Series 9 and above. And also, with, uh, and it will work with any iPhone and with, uh, with a greater 16.0 and higher. And so, yeah, so we are going to set up the Stellar Dexcom with my Apple phone to my Apple Watch Series 9 and the Aurora Ring Gen 4. Enjoy. Okay, well, like you've seen before in my last video, you see that little, uh, that little needle inside that, that's what goes into the skin. Okay, so what we're gonna do like we did before is place it, you got, if you don't want it to hurt you, you gotta have it. Far up oh. And that's every time. I'll be right back. Okay. Well, we are back. And, well, as you seen before, it's right there in the last one. You seen where the last one was above my sensor, how red it is? Man. <laughs> But that's how you do it. Then you go, remember, you go one, two, three to get that sticker down there or whatever that is, the uh, uh, sticky stuff. All right, now we're going to pair it to my Apple phone and my Apple Watch Series 9 and my Royal Ring 4. Enjoy. Okay, well, now we are back on track and all with uh, my Stello Dexcom is now going to be to the Apple Watch Series 9 and to how to set it up to the Aurora Ring 4. All right, well, this is how you get it to set on your watch. Okay. Okay, set little icon right there. This is, well, that is, that is my Stella. That's my sugar right now, 127. Okay. Well, this thing has been working tremendously, and I'm very impressed with it. All right. But what you do, you come over here. You come, well, you come to your app store right there. Okay. Wait till it loads. Okay. And you can go here, type in Stello. Dexcom. Okay. And right there. Say it, mine says open because I've already got it installed. And as you see, what yours will say, do you want to go ahead and install it? Just press yes. Because see, on Android, it does not work for Android automatically. If you want it to work, you're going to have to get an Apple Watch Series 9 or above, like a 10 and above. And it will work on the Apple Watch Ultra 2 and stuff like that. But yes, this thing is working perfectly all you got to do is just uh all you got to do is just press uh install and all you say install on your 
uh, watch and you install it then you come over here and you install the app of Stello on your phone and then it will uh, pop up okay just come over here to your settings go to connections go to Apple Health and get started and then well you don't have to really do all that but anyway that's how you do it it just connect to Apple Health and then there you go and then you're just basically ready to go for your Apple watch now let's do the Aurora ring okay come over here to the Aurora Okay. Okay, everything looks good. Okay. Well, here is my Aurora ring setup. Here's the glucose. What it will say right here down at the bottom, it will say that uh, connect to sensor. What you got to do, uninstall the Stello app on your iPhone, and then from there, uh, connect to uh, come over here, go back here, come up here to this little hamburger thing, then go all the way down here to integrations, and then you'll set up, manage your integration, and then you will go right here, then you will connect the apps of Stello to Strava and stuff like that, and then it will work and all. And then after that, then there you go everything is working now what is really cool about this okay now it's got now we can take pictures of your food and stuff which is pretty cool and it reads what food it is and it will well sometimes it will read and stuff like that but <clears throat> it will let you know what kind of fruit drinks you're drinking hey caffeine man we know now caffeine's been spiking my health and we know caffeine people say caffeine's bad for you and I see that now because caffeine's got a drug in it. That's why people love caffeine. And oh, well, it's been hurting me. And according to everything with my sugar, it's been spiking tremendously with caffeine. So ever since I quit doing caffeine now, hey, I'm not getting alerted or anything. So, and I'm actually enjoying life better now. But you'll come over here to meals. Oh, actually, well, come over here and press this little plus button. Come over here and press meal, and then, then you'll just take your picture of your meal and everything and stuff, and then it will read, and then, like say right here is, there's my, let's see. Yeah, right there is my red fruit juice that I had at, at for supper time, and I was stressed because I was playing my saxophone earlier, and you can see right here with my stress how super high it got. But now it's been back into the engaged. So, yes, um, hyperglycemia, uh, blood sugar, does indicate with stress as well, too, which we know that. So, yeah. But other than that, this is fantastic. But what's my favorite is about the Aurora ring is come over the hamburger icon and come to system radar. And I have no sign of major strain. But now what is interesting. Okay. Here's what really happened. I was, I was ill. I was kind of sick one day. And here I want to show a picture of this. Okay. As you see, it's got minor signs of strain something was straining my body and everything and well i found out i was coming i was man i had a lot of pain and all and i don't know what was wrong with me man but man i was sick and stuff like that but other than that i'm back to normal now i love this this is where it would show cancer and if you got cancer or anything else or stuff whatever's wrong with you but i am good to go with my health so yeah, but I really highly recommend and stuff with this. And I really like this right here, the active part and everything. We're all, I'm walking and everything and stuff like that. So yeah. So now then what we're going to do is 
before we jump into the outro, take a look at my sugar meter, see if it's actually accurate. Now, sometimes it is, sometimes it's not. But hey, who cares? As long as it's working, I'm happy. Okay. Well, you tell me, 104, 127. So you really tell me the accuracy. I really do believe that it's very accurate. It might be mm, about 20 off, but hey, it's not bad as long as it's reading. And so I say, Stello, I say Stello is basically the winner. And I really highly recommend it. So close that out and come back here. And now as you see, right there, 127. And, and there's my watch. So as you see, everything is all synced perfectly. So we are going to jump into the outro. Okay. Well, there we have it. That was the Stello Dexcom with the Apple Watch Series 9 and the Aurora Ring 4. Now, as you see, now we don't need the BGM sugar meter anymore. So that's a very good thing now. So that is now over with. And now, as you see, I don't have any holes much in my fingers now like I used to. So now, welcome to the future. Way to go, Stella. It might be 20% off and everything and stuff of the accuracy of the BGM. But hey, I highly recommend Stella Dexcom and all. So yes, if you like this video, hit the like button, dislike the video, dislike the video, notify me on the bell, and most of all, hit the subscribe button for all of my future content. But yes, and don't forget to follow me on Facebook and Twitter and stuff. And I'll leave all the links down in the description down below. And also, now you get to take pictures of your food and get to see what it's like and everything. Get to watch your sugar spike or stay level and everything. I would love to know from your thoughts and opinions. If you, what, what do you think about Stello? Is Stello the future? I would love to know from your uh, point of view. Until next time, which is basically it's going to be my last video, and I'll be back probably within a year or so from now and stuff like that because my channel, YouTube channel, is not doing good right now and stuff. And it's and I got I'm going to take a lot of money and save a lot of money, and I want to be able to start promoting my videos and stuff in the near future. But I'll be back as the times progress and all. But this is going to be my last video until further notice. Till next time, see ya.